Hello, my name is Ashley Sher, and I'm the founder and CEO of Share Love Fund. Today we're going to explore chapter three, verse four of the Gita. Chapter three, verse four reads as follows. Ceasing to do things will not make you actionless, nor will you rise to perfection simply by renouncing actions. We can understand this as follows. The karma or the desire to act should fall away by itself and like a fully ripened fruit dropping from the tree. If an unripe fruit seeing the ripe fruit dropping from the tree also wants to drop off, it will have to force itself. Renouncing action should come automatically instead of you forcing it by insisting, I renounce. Instead of, trying to push, instead of trying to push your desire out, you can develop a natural state of desirelessness in which you don't feel the need of anything. It's about reducing wants, distinguishing wants from needs. Then you will have truly renounced. You can't force renunciation, but you can prepare yourself in your environment for this and let yourself mature naturally. Namaste.